Are you struggling with inconsistent aim and wonder why it's so hard to see improvement? It's your boy Wantap, and here's some insight on how your settings affect your aim. First things first, pick your settings and stick to them. You can't build consistency if the only constant in your routine is changing your settings every time you see a new video from TENS talking about a new God sense. We'll start with resolution. Your resolution is made up of tiny pixels. Think of it like a 1000 piece puzzle of La Virgen de Guadalupe that your grandma bought at Dollar Tree. Each one of those puzzle pieces is a pixel. And once you put all the puzzle pieces together, you have a complete image that you can look at. I know you're asking yourselves, what does this have to do with aim and precision? The same pixels from your screen resolution go hand in hand with the DPI setting in your mouse. DPI stands for dots per inch, meaning how many pixels your cursor will travel per one inch of physical movement on your mouse pad. But why does my aim feel faster when I keep my DPI the same and change only my resolution? It's important to keep in mind how many pixels are used within your selected resolution. For example, the resolution of 1280 by 720 will only be able to contain 921,600 pixels, while 1920 by 1080 contains 2,073,600 pixels. That is a monstrous difference of 1,152,000 pixels. Since your monitor is staying the same physical size, the individual pixels need to increase in size or density in order to fill up the same amount of visual space. So while you're still at 800 DPI, there are now less pixels to track over. And so this causes the quote unquote change in your sensitivity. So the next time you go and think about changing your in-game sensitivity, DPI, or resolution, take this into consideration and in how it will affect your muscle memory.